Okay, if you could uh, say and spell your first and last name for us. My name is Alex Brown, A-L-E-X-B-R-O-W-N. Okay, thank you so much for meeting us here today. Oh, you're welcome. Tell us a little bit about your service. Uh, right out of high school, I joined the Marine Corps. I did one tour of Iraq, and when I was over there, there was exposure to IEDs, um, mortars, and I suffered from PTSD and TBI. So mm -hmm. it was a, pretty much about that. And then I came home, I got, the, I guess, the minimum care that I could get, and seeing all the Navy doctors and civilian doctors, um, none of them could really diagnose what I was going through at the time. So everyone was saying I had anxiety and other, um, I guess you say side effects of PTSD, but no, no one really wanted to diagnose me with the PTSD or the TBI. So then I got out, started school, and then, you know, I just felt the urge to, you know, start going to the VA to get my appointment and mm -hmm. you know, try and get the help I needed because I was angry all the time, wasn't sleeping, had nightmares, and just, I just got tired of it and, you know, in 2013, we moved back from Deltona area to Jacksonville to be closer to my family and my wife's family and, you know, I came across, you know, just a bunch of people around here with uh, Wounded Warrior magnets on the cars and, you know, that's all I really cared about was just get one of those to, you know, support my brothers and sisters, but, you know, I didn't know where to get them, so I had um, some people I know look online, and one of my friends actually bought me a sticker, and I put it on my car, and then one day I had an appointment over at South Point VA, and I saw a headquarters, I was like, well, I ain't got nothing else to do today, so let's just go over there and see you know, if I can get one. And I come in, and I meet a guy named Casey in the elevator, and sure enough, he was a alumni coordinator, and got to talking and he was like, you know, so what are you here for? I was like, I just wanted to, you know, just wanted a magnet. He's like, well, are you an alumni? I was like, no, I was like, I'm under the impression you have to be literally missing a limb to be part of, you know, the Wounded Warrior Project. 